Hello, this is Joseph from Gorilla3. <clears throat> in our last tutorial, we went over while and for loops. In this tutorial, I'm, about, I'm going to go over namespace and simple user input. Um, namespace basically is allowing you to use variable names or classes without having to type a lot of unnecessary stuff. So, for this example, we're going to be using the scanner class. But in order to use that, we have to type Java dot utilities versus util dot scanner. This just defines the class, and we do, we do scan equals new. And again, we do Java dot util dot scanner brackets. Then we're gonna do system dot in. That allows us to get the input. Scanner can be used to read files as well, which is why we're specifying the system input. And instead of typing utils or java.utils and then java.utils again, we can actually go above right below package and do import java.utils. And we can do the astrophe. Um, it will slow down your compilation time, but um, it will allow you to not have to type repeatedly what you want to import. But since we're only using the scanner um, class, we can type scanner. So we're importing the scanner, and that's all we should need to import. So now we can actually take this off. And it looks much simpler. Scanner scan equals new scanner system that in. Now we're going to find all right what kind of input we want, and we're going to want a string input. So we're going to type string, and we're going to do username equals, and then we type scan dot, and we're going to use next from the scan class. This allows us to read a string from the line they input. There's other types like reading an integer instead of a string, or reading a float, or reading a long, or reading a double. And uh, so now we define that. And then we're going to read back what the input is. So we're going to do system dot out dot um, print line. And we're going to do hello space plus and username so they're going to be asked to input something anything and it's going to reply back with hello username so if we go ahead and save this and rerun it now the and NetBeans IDE it pops up with an input so we're going to put John and then it says what we input and we input and it says hello John that's the basic use of namespace and um, council input. There's other ways to do it, but this is the simplest, but it requires Java 1.5. This ends this tutorial.